What's up guys and welcome to today's video, the first video in quite a few weeks guys. I have been on vacation and I'm not going to lie, I definitely enjoyed myself. Before we get into this video, I want to drop some news on you guys. Hopefully you will go and sub to my new second channel, which is going to be mainly based around MLB The Show. If you guys really do like what I do, please go ahead, go over there, like my channel welcome video, view it as well, and you guys even could subscribe to that channel for me, that would be awesome. I will leave the link down in the description as well as the comments, guys. Please do me a huge favor and go subscribe. I really want to get that channel going. I'm kind of going to do half and half on this channel and then on the other channel, FIFA and MLB The Show. That is the plan for that. But guys, today we have Dennis Bergkamp. Honestly, one of the better legends I've played with on this game. That is why I wanted to get this video out to you guys today. At the end of FIFA, he's getting cheaper. I definitely want you guys to be able to give him a go. Got him in a nice BPL side here. Played very well in some D1 play for me. We're going to go ahead and take a look at his face card stats, guys. He has 83 pace, 90 shooting, 83 passing, 87 dribbling, 26 defense, and 79 physical. A four-star weak foot, four-star skill moves with a medium-low work rate. Um, my first game, guys, got disconnected super fast. Um, EA servers, for some reason, messed up. Uh, that's not typical. Just kidding. Yes, it is. Um, so I did play six games with him, actually, guys, and had some pretty nice stats. As you guys can see, four goals and six assists in six games is pretty unreal, especially the assists. He really just sets up everybody. He's definitely a playmaker, and you'll see that in the highlights. Unfortunately, guys... Uh, I acted like I've never done a review before and forgot to do in-game stats um, on in the game, excuse me, while I was playing. Um, so I'm going to read off some in-game stats that are really key to how Bergkamp plays, guys. He has 96 composure, 93 attack positioning, 92 finishing, 96 penalties, 90 shot power, 91 volleys, 90 reaction, 89 ball control, 88 balance, and 87 dribbling. Some of the key in-game stats for Bergkamp that I really think are a big part of why he's so successful on this game. Like I said, guys, he is uh, sort of cheap right now, so if you guys can go ahead and pick him up, he really is going to change the center midfield position for you if you are lacking that uh, right now at the end of FIFA 17. Definitely looking forward to the icons in FIFA 18. Um, and guys, I will be producing a lot of content. Next year, I kind of just got bummed out on FIFA uh, 17 this year. really wasn't my favorite game. It was fun. Um, I feel like I ruined it by just getting all the good players right away. Um, so I'm probably going to work my way up into the icons by playing a lot of games, and that is what I plan to do. We're now going to go ahead, though, guys, take a look at some highlights for Bird Camp. I'll talk about his pros and cons right now. So we're now going to go ahead, guys, take a look at some highlights, and in a second I'll get right into the pros and cons for Dennis Bergkamp, guys. Really um, just a great player on this game. You'll see in these highlights the way he moves around is really just key to his success on this game and why he plays so well. He's just so good on the ball. Um, that is going to be my first um, pro for him, guys, is his movement on and off the ball, guys. Burkamp really knows how to work his way into um, positions that make him a threat, both as a playmaker and setting up goals, and as well as shooting, guys. I do have him in the cam role. I don't suggest him in the center mid role, um, but he can also play striker. I played him at striker last year, and he went off, scored more goals than assists, obviously, because he's usually in more of a scoring position. I think his best position, though, is at the cam roll. As you guys see, some of the passes that he makes in these highlights um, are absolutely unreal. That is going to be my second pro, guys. His passing, six assists in six games, nothing. You can't really ask for much more than that. I'm sure he could have even had more a couple times. I didn't finish them off for him, as you've seen a couple in these highlights already. I think the very first one, um, Gabriel Jesus somehow missed a goal when he... The goalie wasn't even in the goal, so. Uh, but really, guys, Burkamp, nice run there, as you guys can see. Just the way he moves, the way he passes, the give and goes with him are very crucial. I think before the end of this FIFA, I'm definitely going to do a team with Burkamp and Van Basten, two of my favorite uh, Dutch players on this game. Could even imagine having Burkamp, Van Nistelrooy, and Van Basten. Don't quite have the coins for that right now, um, but that would be an amazing team, guys. My third pro, four. Uh, Dennis Bergkamp, guys, is his dribbling, four-star skills, as well as just having great ball control. As you can see right there, just weaving in and around defenders. Unfortunately, couldn't finish that one off, guys. But just the way he works around the ball is absolutely unreal. 
um, and his dribbling definitely helps his movement and his passing. Really just, it all goes together for Bear Camp. Really a complete card for the center attacking mid position, guys. And I don't have anything bad to say about him, so I do not have any cons for Bear Camp. Just an unreal card. If you guys can pick him up, try and give him a go. We're now going to go ahead, guys, take a look at his summary. As you can see there, guys, he has a 9.6 out of 10 on the 10 scale rating guys his pros are listed as well as his goals and assists in the games played just an overall amazing looking card guys and i hope you enjoyed this video guys like i said please go sub to my other channel i hope you guys enjoyed this video guys as always feedback is appreciated if you guys are feeling crazy hit that like or subscribe button and until next time i will talk to you later